I asked my friend the other day, I'm like, what do you do for a foreplay when you hook up with a girl? And he's like, I don't know, I really like uh, fucking on the couch. I think that's pretty cool. <laughs> that's what they think. They think as long as it's out of the bedroom, that counts. Fully penetrating a woman on a couch. <laughs> foreplay. No, foreplay is, it's simple. It's, it's kissing, it's compliments, it's going to therapy. It's just work on yourself. Whisper in my ear that you're ready to address your anger with your dad and I'll fucking, you'll get an alert on your phone about a flash flood. I'll get wet so fast. <laughs> Evacuate caves. Like I, I can get wet. I just, you, dry humping, man, I get turned on just thinking about dry humping. I could ride a knee into the goddamn sunset. Give me a knee. A knee clad in denim and I can just get up on it. Like Don Quixote up in this bitch. I love dry humping. I want to invent a move called the reverse Santa where a girl just, you get, they face you sitting down, you get on their knee, you grind it out, you tell them what you want for Christmas, they call you a good girl and then you take a picture. And that's <laughs> coming to a mall near you this holiday season. That's what I want. Just do stuff to us that isn't our vagina. Like just keep it dry before it's wet. I think dry humping's great. We all are wearing jeans now like this that have like a, a seam right where the seams meet. There's like a, um, a bump. It's called a clit knobbin. That's the name that Levi Strauss gave it in his blueprints for the original 501s. But that's good. You use that and just, that's a huge bump there. He put it a little low because every guy thinks your clit is like where your hole is. It's like, oh, he thought it was where the hole is. So you gotta hike it up, but um, and it is hard to locate a clit. I don't mean to like judge a guy for not knowing. Sometimes I look down there, I'm like, I don't know where the fuck this thing is hiding today. Keep a little post-it on it now. It's easy, <laughs> easy to locate, but you gotta be sucking clit. Uh, do you guys know about that? Clit stuff's important and sucking clit is where it's at. I didn't know anything about sucking clit. I would have done the same thing that you guys do when you go down on us. If I, if I went down on a girl, I would have done the same styles. I would just rub my face in it until I hit something. Like, that's good. I like that. Keep that. I do enjoy it. It's like when I play video games, I like press all the buttons and I win. I'm just like, just same logic. However, you gotta be sucking clit. Let me tell you about this. I didn't even know about sucking clit until I got sent a toy that did it for me. This woman had heard me talk a lot about how I, for me to have an orgasm, I need like a lot of pressure, peer. And so she's like, you need the womanizer. And I was like, yeah, I've been trying to slide into John Mayer's DMs for a while now. And I was like, he writes LOL. And then we just kind of peters off. And she's like, no, I'm talking about a tool. And I was like, yeah, so am I. But I guess he's I like some of his songs. And so we had a little back and forth, a little who's on first. And then she sent me this toy. And it blew my mind because you put it over your clit and it sucks your clit. It has three settings. It's low, medium, squirt. And then it... <laughs> I swear to you, you can squirt. I didn't think I could, and now I know I can do anything. <laughs> you can do anything. I never could squirt, and I wanted to because I think it's such a cool power move. Like, just to just dump a quart of water on a guy's bed and be like, peace, and just like, catch you on the flip, dude. Like, nothing cooler than that to me. No, it's like sucking clit makes sense, dude. It really does. Because clits and penises are pretty much the same thing, like the same nerve endings. So what you really need to treat it like is like go down on a girl and suck her clit like you would a tiny version of your penis, okay? I know that feels weird to say and to even do, but I swear to God, if you go down there and you just treat her clit like you would your tiny little penis and you suck that tiny little penis, you're gay. You're so gay. That's the gayest shit I ever heard. Why would you do that? Oh.